Le Chatelier's Principle, Concentration, Higher Content by kscience.com In this reversible reaction, iodine monochloride reacts with chlorine to form iodine trichloride. This is a reversible reaction. The balance symbol equation is ICl alpha liquid reacts with Cl2 G for gas reacts to form ICl3 S for solids and this is a reversible reaction. Iodine monochloride is a brown liquid. Chlorine is a yellow green gas and iodine trichloride forms yellow crystals. As this is a reversible reaction, a dynamic equilibrium can be reached. A dynamic equilibrium is where this reversible reaction has forward and backward reactions which are happening at the same or equal rate. Reversible reactions like to be at dynamic equilibrium in nature. So what happens if the concentration is changed? It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. Well, to answer this question, what happens if the concentration is changed? We're going to increase the concentration of chlorine gas to see how this affects the position of the dynamic equilibrium. Well, when we increase the concentration of the chlorine gas, the rate of the forward reaction increases to counteract the change. This causes more iodine trichloride yellow crystals to be formed as the rate of the forward reaction increases. So as the chlorine reacts, this causes the concentration of the chlorine to decrease. So as the chlorine decreases, this means there is more iodine trichloride being produced. So more iodine trichloride produced causes concentration of chlorine to decrease. So increasing chlorine has been cancelled out. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. We're now going to focus on what happens to the position of the dynamic equilibrium when the concentration of chlorine is decreased and we decrease the concentration of chlorine gas. Well, what happens is the rate of the backward reaction increases to counteract the change. This causes the amount of iodine trichloride to decrease as it turns into chlorine, causing the amount of chlorine to increase. So more chlorine is produced where the breakdown of iodine trichloride causes the concentration of chlorine to increase. So the decrease in chlorine has been cancelled out. It's question time. Attempt these questions to check your understanding. We can use Le Chatelier's principle to explain why this has happened. Le Chatelier's principle states that if a change in conditions is introduced to a dynamic equilibrium, the position of the equilibrium will move to cancel out the change. To understand this in more detail, here is a reversible reaction between NO2 and N2O4. If this reversible reaction is in a state of dynamic equilibrium and we increase the concentration, this causes the rate of the forward reaction to increase, causing more products to be formed. Therefore, the position of the equilibrium moves to the right until a new equilibrium is reached. Now, let's say we decrease the concentration of NO2. This will cause the rate of the backward reaction to increase so less products are formed, causing more reactants to be formed. So the position of the equilibrium moves to the left until a new equilibrium is reached. 
Pause the video here to practice the keywords. The answers will follow. Press pause to answer the questions. The answers will follow. If stuck, just rewatch the video. Press pause to go through your answers and make any corrections to your mistakes. And don't forget to visit kscience.com for more videos, worksheets and quizzes at kscience.com. And don't forget to like and subscribe.